in the early game, you're really broke. But using this method, you can get a ton of money super quickly with almost an empty inventory. Now, to prove it, I've completely emptied out my inventory and my accessory bag, minus the piggy bank, to show that all you need are just a few items. Now, this Moby Shears, I will tell you how to get it. It's super cheap. And this Rogue Sword, you can get it for free from one of the NPCs. All you need to start this is around 80,000 coins and access to the Bazaar. Now, what you want to do is you want to head to the Bazaar, and you're going to want to go into Chum, and you're going to want to place a buy order for 320 Chum. It should only set you back at max 2,000 coins, and it should give you five stacks of this stuff. If you don't already have your Rogue Sword, then you can talk to this NPC to get it completely for free. Now what you want to do is you want to head to the Mushroom Desert, which for sake of time, I'm just going to go through the portal on my island. Now, once you're in the Mushroom Desert, you're going to want to head to the Glowing Mushroom Cave, which you can use your Rogue Sword to get there pretty quickly. Just go straight, forward, across this lake, through here, make a turn, and then just keep going straight right off the edge. Don't worry about fall damage. Now you're going to want to head into this crystal area over by this lake. And you're going to want to talk to the NPC over here named Moby. Now, Moby will have to pull have you do some quests before you can buy stuff from him. But once you can buy stuff from him, you're gonna wanna get the Moby Shears, which will cost five full chum buckets and 15 glowing mushrooms, which you can obtain pretty easily from this. I The Moby Shears are optional, but they make it things twice as fast. So I greatly encourage you to get them. Now, this method involves getting glowing mushrooms, trading them for empty chum buckets, turning them into full chum buckets, and then trading them for stuff that Moby offers. In order to do this, you need to find glowing mushrooms, which glowing mushrooms are like these mushrooms on the ground, except they have particles that come off of them. Now, I recommend that you install a mod called Not Enough Updates, because it allows you to highlight these with orange boxes or boxes of any color you're choosing. Like this. It's pretty difficult to see with the shaders, but you can easily see the particles. And when you collect them, you'll notice that you'll not only get the normal mushrooms, but also these glowing mushrooms. Now, if you collect them with your most shears, you get two of them, which is why it's such good. Now, I won't be showing you the full thing because you have to collect four stacks of these. You can buy that, and then what you're going to want to do is empty out your hotbar, except for the chum and the chum buckets, and you're going to head to this lake, and you're going to want to place down your empty chum bucket, you're going to want to fill it with chum, and then with an empty hand, you're going to want to pick it up. Now you can just repeat that cycle until all the chum buckets are full. I'll time lapse this again. But it really shouldn't take longer than five minutes, even if you have multiple stacks. Great, all of our buckets are filled. Now with these full chum buckets, you have some options. With just 32, 
the only real thing you can buy is the chumming talisman, which you can sell for about 600,000 on a normal basis. However, if you have 64 and some spare glowing mushrooms, you could buy a mixin. I know these mixins sell for a lot more than just two chumming talismans, however, they don't sell very often, and the raw, cra the raw craft cost isn't much more than what two chumming talismans would make you. So I wouldn't recommend it unless you're really patient. You just want to go to here and trade in for a chumming talisman. Now you just go slash hub. You're gonna want to head to the auction house to sell it for six hundred thousand on a buy it now. And these things sell pretty good. Um, there's a, it says six sales per day, but on average it's a lot more than that. So chances are that this will sell within twenty four hours, and that's a very easy six hundred thousand coins, which is crazy considering that only took me about fifteen minutes to make. It is amazing early game. And that's it for the tutorial. It, you can get up to 5 million an hour doing this, but it's really difficult. And on average, you'll get around 4 million an hour doing this. I would recommend that you do this until you can grind uh, zealots in the end dimension. And then that will be a greater, uh, a greater strategy to make more money. But you do need a high combat, good sword, and good armor to do that. So until you get that, you can just sell chumming talismans. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will have more tutorials on Skyblock. I understand I have not uploaded videos in forever, but I've been playing Skyblock.